rifled his first pro TD to Wendell Davis. Uh, he's not, not a massive ego that needs to be massaged more than it's been massaged. But again, uh, it's just speculation. First and ten as Willis lost one into the end zone, and Waddle makes the catch for the touchdown. It's hard for me not to imagine Bill Parcells coaching. I mean, well, he does it so well. I understand that, Dan. It's just, yeah. uh, I think he walked away from it at the very top. He walked away from, I think, the best job in football. He's got great ownership. He's got a great football man in George Young. A lot of people said that uh, we look at Waddle again with a great catch. A lot of people said that Bill Parcells wanted to do it all. I don't think that's the case whatsoever. And whether he comes back to it, of course, again, is going to be just pure speculation. By Carl Lee, the multiple Pro Bowl defensive back for the Vikings. Second and ten. Willis throwing for the end zone touchdown. Wendell Davis. 38 to 9. You can hang up any sign you want. <laughs> Felix Wright, number 22, is the DB in coverage, and he looks mesmerized. Cleveland had given up the fewest touchdowns in the league coming into the game, but the Bears score two, both in the air. Hard running by Neal after the catch, 30 yards from PT, and Cleveland's lead was then at 13 to 7. And if Brown show a four man rush, and it's a four man rush that's coming. Over the middle goes PT Willis. It's Anderson cutting left to the 20 to the 15. Breaks a tackle to the 10 to the 5. Touchdown! Game right after the uh, punt return. First play from scrimmage, and PT throws it to Tom Waddle. Wide open, and he's gone for a 68 yard touchdown pass play. The Bears back in it within six and had the ball down. The Oiler 18 yard line. Peter Tom Willis from the shotgun. Throws over the middle to Neil Anderson, and Neil Anderson in for the touchdown. A turn of events. Willis stands in there. He had Jones coming from the other side, and for the second time, Frank, on this drive, he demonstrates.